We back. What's good, family? So, last time we left off, we were supposed to be taking off the gas tank. Uh, I'm just now getting around to that. So, stay tuned in. I'm about to put y'all on a little time lapse. If I can get a good angle. And we're going to see if we can get this gas tank taken off. Let's get it. All right, you two, I'm back. I don't know how good you could tell in the time lapse after the tank come down. I know it was kind of blocking the camera, but I was in a bad position. I couldn't really move it. But as you can see, fuel pump is out. Yeah. So one more step closer. And honestly... I'm going to put some fire to this thing and test it, but honestly, I don't think it's broke. It's actually kind of new because I put it in not too long ago when I first started back working on this car, but uh, we'll see. Hopefully, it's bad so I didn't take it out for nothing, and so we know it's an easy fix. Just swap this out. So, make sure you stay tuned in. Like, share, subscribe. Oh, yeah, and for a bonus. For a bonus. Let's see. Hold on, hold on. I found something under here that I haven't seen in like freaking, I don't know, 15 years maybe. For a bonus. <laughs> Do y'all remember these? <laughs> Can anybody tell me what this is? Not only what it is, but what kind it is. Anybody that can, the first person to tell me what this is and what kind it is gets, I don't know, a free TNG sticker and a free float towel. Let me know in the comments. The first one to tell me what this is and what type it is gets a free float towel and a TNG sticker. Like, share, subscribe. Let's get it. All right, YouTube. So, I'm back. I got some bitter sweet news. So, seeing I got Oh, yeah, and sorry that y'all couldn't see the footage where I time-lapsed it and took the gas tank out because uh ended up being, like, four seconds of footage. And when I tried to add it into the video, every time when I, like, was doing the editing or whatever, every time when I tried to add it in, it kept modifying it and not showing anything. So, sorry that clip's not in there. But, as I was saying, I got this pump out yesterday. I tested this pump yesterday. The freaking pump works. So, I did all that for nothing. Uh, I'm going to have to put the pump back in, obviously, and put the gas tank back up. But, bittersweet news because the pump actually does work. But, it's bitter because now I don't know what the issue is. Like I said before, I had just bought this pump before I put it in or whatever. 
and like everything on it was solid. Like what no lines messed up or like everything was solid. I put a new fuel filter in here already. I uh got the re rebuilt the injectors and stuff already. All those should be good. So now I'm thinking it might be an ECU problem because it's acting like it ain't getting gas, even though it's getting gas. And it's getting plenty of fire because, as you know, I replaced the distributor, the cap, all that stuff. I, I replaced the wires, the plugs. Like, I done did the whole fuel system. I done did the whole ignition system. And it still acts like it's not getting gas. So, I guess the next issue is, or the next thing to try is going to be an ECU. And if the ECU don't work, then I really don't know. Like, it might be an old wiring issue. Like, maybe some rats chewed up some wires or something somewhere, and I just can't find it. Um, I really don't know. I, I'm really stuck right now, and it's really getting on my nerves. Like, I, I'm really ready to just freaking set the car on fire and, and, and scrap it. But, as you know, I had this car forever, so I couldn't do that. It'd be just fucked up. The next best thing I'm thinking about, I, I got to find a parts car, honestly. That's that's really what that comes down to. Because if I find a whole parts car I can take any and everything off of, then it, there shouldn't be an issue. Well, I'm not paying freaking three, four thousand dollars for no freaking parts car. It's not freaking worth it. This car is freaking old as fuck. And then, uh, uh, like, I tried to do the other scenario and just keep buying brand new parts and brand new parts and brand new parts. But enough is enough. Like, I done bought so many parts for this car. And I ain't getting nowhere with it, basically. Because it's still not running. I'm talking about transmission, clutch, flywheel, all new motor mounts. Got the injectors rebuilt, brand new fuel filter, brand new distributor, brand new plug wires, brand new plugs, radiator, freaking uh the emission system or whatever. I replaced that. Like, what the fuck? <laughs> you know what I mean? I don't know where I'm at right now. You guys, brand new clutch cable, freaking like, I don't even freaking know. Like, I've done bought so many parts for this car in the last year. And the fact that it's still not running is driving me crazy. I ain't going to lie to you. It's really getting on my nerves. So, uh, I'm either going to have to find a parts car or I'm going to just buy another, like a brand new engine and a brand new harness or something like that well i don't even think you can buy it honestly because i haven't seen it like you can buy like a crate like built racing engine but it's kind of hard to just find the engine it's kind of hard to find a rate uh, engine or transmission like when i was looking for a transmission the transmissions that i were finding were like 1300 dollars or something like that just for the transmission. And like, it, it's really hard to find like a used one or something like that. I think I found one on eBay. Guy was wanting like 800 or 900 for, but it was like fucking two or $300 to ship it. So I guess still like $1,200 for just the transmission. And like, I don't know. These cars are like really expensive to get parts on and hard to find. So anybody got some advice? Let me know down in the comments. Anybody got a lead on some parts? Let me know in the comments. Like, share, subscribe. Stay tuned in, you guys. I ain't giving up. You know what I'm saying? I ain't giving up. I'm going to do whatever it takes to get this baby running again. Like, seriously. Let's get it.